for these teams. As Jared Allen and Avisa Zubats get ready to jump it up. Ball is up. Game is on. Cavaliers from the tap will have it to start the fourth as well. Brian, you kind of mentioned the, the fact that Distant hasn't been able to find the stroke, but he played a great game yesterday for the Clippers. Seven of eight from the field with 14 is Garland gets things started. Both big men will run the floor for the Cavaliers. We see the lob pass for Paul George to go to the rim a little bit too high. I thought you said it was the big men that will run the floor. Mitchell, Paul George. Turns the corner, gets it to Jackson. Swings it to a wide open. Morris for three. It is good. And the Clippers extend the possession with nine to shoot. That's what going to have to do the entire evening. Battle those two. Good guys. We see Paul George knock down the three. Second shot opportunities. So important. To shoot from the perimeter over their outstretched arm as they close out. The bird is shifting. North, south, east, west misses. And... Pet Tech Enterprise. Hello? Your translation device works. Well, Mobley is very effective. Struggling from the field, struggling with his health. Bump knees yesterday was clearly laboring, toughing it out here tonight with John Wall not able to play back to back. Mitchell could work. He usually likes to go to the left side of the arc. That time he hit it from the right. That time Paul George hit it from wherever Paul George wants to go on the court. Over the defender that the Clippers are putting on him. As a result, we've seen him shoot right over the top. George finds his team, takes it to the house with a two handed flush. I wouldn't put it past him, but Levert comes away with that long rebound. Mitchell, quick grab, fires a three and knocks it in. Three triples now for the Cavaliers. Morris sets his feet, fires a three. Clippers have taken 15 shots. Ten of them are threes here in this first quarter. Mitchell, quick trigger three. He knocks it down. Mitchell will take some time off the ticker now, requesting the screen from Osmond. Stops on the wing. He fires a three. Dueling banjos. Mitchell, by the way, five of six with 14 here in this first quarter. Well, then, when you, excuse me, when you mentioned two for one, this is what you are talking about. They get another opportunity now to score. George creates space again, flicks the wrist. Oh, bucket for George! to move the basketball as you mentioned before play the right way well the right way is to find the open man and get it to him speaking of open man terrence what you just said kind of a whole different story garland clever move inside better pass better finish as soon as the layup happened he put his hand up and say that's my bad terrence man to the rim back to the basket lays it in contorting his body and lays it home terrence man with five that's not, you don't always have to look at it like that. It could be something else. Maybe he's asking for help. Ball don't lie. Clippers get it back. Man attacks on Garland. Oh, a finger roll finish for Terrence Mann. He has seven. Paul George, I think this is conservative. A top five two-way player in the NBA right now. 47-46. Love for three. I will say this. Coach Fratello said if Kevin Love makes his first shot. If you're going to try and get over the screen, you wind up trailing. If that guard can keep you on his hip, he's in command. George steps into a three. Surprised he could even get that shot off. He had to work so hard for it. Like you said, it was halfway down and came out. Mitchell swerves his way down the lane. He fades and fires and fills it up. Donovan Mitchell with 16 timeout clippers. LaVert. Played on three teams the last three seasons. George, a step back, foul circle jumper, and it's good. Paul George with 16. And is the reason that Wall was not playing because of back-to-back -back games, is that it? That is correct. They're managing his minute. Paul George is on another bender here. He is 7 of 12, and he has a game-high 18. Look at the corner of the man. On the wing to Morris, driven off the line. Knocks it in ahead of the horn. Morris with 10. And the Cavaliers will hold it as the buzzer sounds, and we are tied at 64. That time, a little bit of confidence in that three-point shot, and he knocks it down. Allen bounces to Mobley. I actually switched from Chrome to Opera GX a while ago just because I was so tired of Chrome being the absurd resource hog that it is and performing terribly. It's fully customizable. Well, he, he was pinned beneath the net. 13 assists, and there was sharing of the basketball taking place out there. Garland for three. He is special. He knocks it down. 12 points for him on 5 of 10 shooting. 
Paul George leads all Clippers with 18. It's a screen from Zoo who rolls. George calls his own number using Zoo as a barricade, goes right to the rim and leaves it in. Zoo is that moving wall that PG who's able to get behind and get a wide open look at the layup. Garland jitterbucks his way down the lane, lobs it up high to Mobley. That next guy has to make the right decision, which he's doing for the Clippers. Teeter totter third quarter. Cavaliers out in front, Mobley doing so much damage inside. He has 22 points on 10 of 14 shooting. Hottest team in the NBA, winners of eight in a row. George pokes it free, one of the league leaders in deflections. Garland dancing around the defense, goes to the rim, floats it home. Garland five to shoot. Man tries to attack again. Fade, one legged jumper, and is good. Terrence Mann looks like a completely different player the last couple of times out. He has a dozen. Kicks it back outside to Terrence Mann. Jackson, deep three, late in the clock. Book it! Knocked down a huge three just when the team needed it. Big government delivers the bailout again for the Clippers. Mitchell back the other way again. 19 for Mitchell. Tied at 78. George rises for three. Oh, my goodness, he can throw a key into a lock. 23 for Paul George. For the Cavaliers, Clippers lead by one. Clippers 6 of 12 here in the quarter. Cavaliers 7 to 13. Tough shot for Mobley. Lays it in off the window. He has 24. Breaking out of it right now against a very elite defensive team. Morris knocks it down 15 for Marcus Morris. That said, Mobley is a stud. Mitchell, sidestep three. Talk about studs. 22 for Donovan Mitchell. 145 to play in the third, but two makes the read. Morris fields it low, shoots it high, and rips the cords. 18 for Morris. Lots of threes, but not a lot of makes. Let's see what they can do here in the final 12 against an elite team like the Cavaliers. And Donovan Mitchell continues to smolder. He has 25. And Love has the rebound and a two-point lead for the Cavaliers. We've had 16 lead changes, six ties. And Mitchell drains another three. 28 for Donovan Mitchell. Seven to shoot for Mitchell. Trying to get the ball out of his hands. They get it to Love. Into Allen. What a read. What a finish. Counted in a foul. What a great play and a great sequence for the Cavaliers. Garland will walk it through the center court logo. Plenty of time remains. Turns the corner after an Allen screen. Comes up firing in the mid-range. Garland now with 18 points and 12 assists in the lead balloon. Back to seven. Clean it up from the drive. Break down the defense. Nice pass off by Reggie. Great ball movement for the Clippers. Better interior defense by Allen and the Cavaliers. Lavert sidesteps Batum and lays it in. 101-92. Guards are back in there with their hands digging. Shot blockers change your shot. Norman Powell sheds his defender and Mitchell and makes him pay as he reigns in a three. Powell a perfect 4-4 four four tonight. The feeling both the Jazz and the Cavaliers are very happy with the trade. Marketing has been phenomenal for Utah. 103-95. Jackson down the lane and down the hatch. Reggie Jackson with 14. Down, let us get a clean look at you. 106-98, low for the straight on three. It's good again. You said it to me before the ball game. When Kevin Love makes his first shot. We are progressing. We're making some, some nice plays. We're trending in the right direction. Deflection. Interception by man with Garland to beat. Flushes it in with the right hand. Powell to tie. area in case they double team Paul George. George accelerates down the lane off the window hot damn the Clippers take the lead counted on a foul no timeouts Mitchell gets it poked away for a moment by George Mitchell recovers dumps it to Mobley takes it to the rim for the flush it's a one point game with 29 seconds let you get hit Jackson trying to dot. Mitchell, deep three. Between raindrops, Mitchell. He missed that one on purpose. Rebound batted around. George gets it. He's looking for the foul this time. 
He missed it with no timeouts. Love. Oh, my goodness. My heart was in my throat, but the Clippers hold on. When do you spray Febreze air? After every flush. In my kitchen.